Okay, hey and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a summertime smoky eye look for you guys. Um, at first I wasn't sure what I wanted to film, so I just like played around and I loved how it turned out. So if you like what you see and you want to achieve this look, keep on watching. First, I moisturized and primed my skin using the Nivea Soft Skin Moisturizer and the ELF a Hydrate and Face Primer. Then I'll be doing my eyebrows and I'll be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Definer in the color Dark Brown. Next, I'll be using the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the color 30 Cafe and my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Beautiful Bronze to clean up my brow. Then I'll be using my Urban Decay Brow Tamer Gel to set my eyebrows in place. Now, I'll be taking my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion to prime my eyelids. I'll be going into my Morphe 350 palette and I'm taking this light brown color to set under my brow bone. Then I'll be taking this semi light brown color and using it as a transitioning shade. Then I'm going back into this palette with a deeper brown and I'll be using that as my crease color. Then I'll be going into my Urban Decay Vice 4 palette and I'll be taking the color Delete which is a really deep brown and I'll be using that as the smoky part of the eye. So the star of the show is the Milani Bella Copper Eyeshadow. Um, it's like the perfect bronzy golden look for summer and I think it really made the eyes pop. Next, I'll be taking my Anglot number 77 black gel liner. Um, I'm not a pro at gel liner or winged eyes, so this is just like how I do it. And it worked out pretty well, so I'm pretty proud of myself.
So now I'm going to be taking my Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation in the color 360 Mocha and just apply that all over my face. Now I'll be taking my LA Girl Pro Conceal in the color Fawn. Uh, I applied a little bit too much concealer and it led to me having sort of a difficult time blending the, all of the concealer out. It's going to lead to me having like a kind of a lighter, lightish look to my face. So just don't use as much concealer as I did and you'll be fine. Now I'll be taking my black opal foundation stick in the color black walnut to contour. I'll be contouring the hollows of my cheeks and my nose. Now I'll be taking my Sasha Buttercup setting powder just to um, set the areas that I highlighted with concealer so nothing creases. Now I'll be taking my Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara just to apply some mascara to the lashes and my L'Oreal True Match face powder in the color N8 Cappuccino just to set um, my face further. Now I'll be taking my CoverGirl bronzer in the color Ebony Bronze just to warm up my cheeks a little bit and my forehead. Next I'll be taking ColourPop's blush in the color Pegacorn just to apply some color to my cheeks. It's like a rosy pink color and I think it went really well with this look. It's really pretty. Next, I'll be taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Illuminator in the color Peach Nectar. Um, this is my favorite highlighter. Favorite, hands down. It's just so glowy and beautiful. It's just amazing. Now I'm just lining my lips with a NYX um, brown lip pencil. I'll be taking the new Too Faced Melted Matte Lipstick in the color... Queen B, and then now I'll just be setting my face with the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray.
and that's it for the final look thank you guys so much for watching if you'd like to see more looks please don't forget to like comment and subscribe thank you bye